I'm here in my classroom and I have a class title for a course I haven't set up at all yet. So to get into that, I'm going to click on it here in my view of my courses and you see basically nothing is set up here at all. So maybe I just want to set up some of the basic information. So I'm going to go to settings and I can change what this is called if I want to. I can choose an image for the class. Uh, I'm not sure what I have here in my pictures, but let's see. about yeah, here we go here's a programmer stick that in there and it'll center it um, based on these course these dimensions and then I can give it a description if I want this is the classroom for the CTD department to share and um, I can take a look at what's available in here. Um, under navigation, I can choose what my students are actually able to see and click on over here. So when you look at the left-hand menu, if something's grayed out, it means either there actually are none of those available to look at, or the, the teacher has decided not to make that a clickable link. Um, so one thing, for example, that you might want to remove is here where it says grades because that's going to be the grade calculated based just on what you have inside this uh, system. And if you have quizzes or tests or something that you give in addition to this that actually go in your real grade book, those won't be incorporated here. So you might want to just make this not be a link in the class. Um, you can disable it. And then it won't appear over here on the left hand side. So your students won't see like confusing information about what their grades are can also enable other apps. Um, a lot of stuff is enabled right from the start, so you might likely won't actually need to do that. Um, but then when you're ready and you've set up what you want, you can say update course details. And if I go back out to my dashboard, you'll see now this course tile has a picture set. Uh, for the people who are going to see this as one of the courses they're enrolled in.